Uh, but anyway, well, we reached to an agreement that it is bunch of betas is run. They're running the whole show yeah. by alphas in the shadows. Yes, I I agree. So let's talk about something. I else. was I wasn't talking about the shadow people. I wasn't talking about the shadow. Ooh, the alpha, shadow people. I like the terminology. Alphas who are in the shadows. I Ooh. I was talking about the betas who are in the limelight. I gave you the statement which is limelight. If you try to okay, we disagreed. Why are you still roaming around the bushes? Like, okay, <laughs> now let, let, let's end this. Let's let's end this. As you as you asked me, like, is Elon Musk a good fit for handling Twitter? I would say no. Let me explain you why. He he doesn't have a slight idea how to control a social media platform. Social media yeah. plat social yeah, no not, no no. He's a, he didn't say that he's a uh, social media genius. He's just a technologist. Right? Yeah, I'll I'll explain you why. The the simplest answer is the way he thinks is not. less logical the way he's an in, he's a, he has a mindset of technological mindset he has a mindset of an engineer he he thinks in a technological aspect if you are controlling a social media platform anything which is related to social media you have to keep the technicality outside cause social media is not technical it's bullshit you have to have a mindset of bullshit to control a social media platform you have a mindset uh, have like you think as if it's a technological uh, um, industry no it's not can you hold on can you explain to us the <laughs> bullshit mindset yeah yeah you 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 have to keep the technicality outside for example you want to control uh, twitter you want to uh, reach something Here. you want here is what i'm going to say it's going to be funny and controversial and 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 um conspiracy as fuck right, but yay mm-hmm. my they said where there's smoke there's fire yeah. yay said elon might be a chinese agent <laughs> <laughs> i'm not Mr. saying <laughs> i'm not saying but if this shit turns out that he happens to be chinese agent they got tiktok mm. they got twitter Instagram is falling behind. I'm just saying, yeah. bro, like this shit is going to be meta as fuck, bro. Like it's it's yeah, it, it hey, I hope not, but hey, I it can it could go I, either way. Yeah, so. I I would say I would say I would say it might sound controversial and who knows if Elon even comes up and listens to this video in the future. Uh, it's my uh, opinion on it, but Elon Musk is nowhere close to handling a social media platform. He is not technically fit I mean, he can I mean, he can who, own the platform who is no i'll tell you who is i he can own the pl- on, yeah we got it but who is we're asking you no i'll I, i'll come to that point i'll we, come to that we, point we we need to we need to outsource it no we need to outsource it no i i'll come to the i'll come to the conclusion we're asking you like in your opinion who you think is a good fit no i l- 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 let, let me come to say the say one name let me come to just the say a name <laughs> damn it <laughs> i don't know i don't See? know exactly no <laughs> nobody knows nobody knows no nobody <laughs> i'll tell you something like everyone i will tell you i will i'll give like you like nobody knows what gi- is happening no, 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 in this no. world i will i, I <laughs> We're Fine. all sitting down here and we're learning. Fine. But it's we're trying to give power. one person so much credit. For real, bro. Final statement. Because he's got so much money. Exactly. No, 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 so no, no, no. Let, 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 let me say you this. Who? I'll tell you who. A person, a person, a person who doesn't think, you know, in a technical way. If a person who doesn't think in a technical way, he'll be a good fit for being a But, handling Twitter. Because if you are technical, you can't handle a social media platform. Alright, Nancy Pelosi, you got a job. Cause, 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 I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. Cause it is controversial because because there are a lot of pussies on the internet. There are a lot of pussies on social media platform. They, you want to handle them. You can't think in a way which is very technical. You have to have a less technical mind on it. Are you talking about the trolls? the trolls of the internet no not just trolls like every look at this nowadays okay you go outside you go outside all these kids they are they 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 consider themselves a big shot what do you do nothing social media what the hell is that half of the popul- they're making no, no, money no, no. no i'll tell you something okay half of the social media Content. okay instagram 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 how much like let's talk about kylie jenner okay mm-hmm. kylie or okay. she has a makeup line don't even Okay, like okay. She's a hard working woman. Yeah, hard working very hard working woman. 
Very hard working I don't know why you motherfuckers okay. laugh. She's lucky. Hey, she's fell, lucky. She, she is lucky, but her fell, she, yes, she came from 100 million at 200 million, 500 million dollar family. And she became a billionaire in her family. Yeah, if you sell makeup. Because you're fucking pretty. And the fucking Chinese people. Is that her fucking, fucking problem? That is groundless. Gra- no, 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 no. She's she's lucky. Lucky. We were, oh we were, let, let me, let me, let me, let me tell you. We were talking uh, about social media. No. We were talking about social media. Okay. Mm. A lot of people on the social medias who show themselves off oh we're influencers this that blah 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 shit i don't give a shit i don't give a shit Mm -hmm. why let me tell you something all these pussies they think they are big shots over there okay now like let me see you have a social media platform you are a high fi social influencer you have like 100 million followers okay how many followers are true tell me that how many of them there are a lot of fake accounts there are a lot of fake accounts there are a lot of fake accounts i will tell you something okay you the lesser the person educated okay the lesser the person is educated he'll he'll have the more accounts okay i know a person he has 12 accounts 12 freaking instagram accounts uh-huh. and he follows the same person 12 times he had 12 followers extra for the fucking same guy he he does that to every single one but i don't think education has to do with it no, i guess i could no, yes he's a psycho there are a lot of people who are like that when I talk to India, okay, well, well, let, let me go back to Indian, let me go back to yes, l- the Indian population. Please, I'm interested. Okay, let me go back to Indian population. Hold it. How, oh. how many people do you think who That's have social media platforms over there are legit? Half of them are not legit over there. Okay. Mm. They are uh, like, for example, recently NBA is trying to make Virat Kohli, he's a uh, cricket player of India, as NBA's ambassador. Why? They want Indian po- uh, population. They want Indian publicity. Right, yes. How many? 1.2 billion people in the Yeah, something like that. The yeah. second most populated country in the well, world. Like, uh, fucking rugby is the. What is that rugby? Was that what, cricket? cricket? Yeah, cricket. It's the most watched sport. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's the most watched sport in India. There's so many. Like, fuck where you. I understand. Not only saying, India. Because there's so many. There's so many. Uh, there's so many Indian. The population is so big, but they themselves and. I mean, in, this is an important sport. But not only in India. And it's crazy to fucking understand, yeah. like yeah. just. Okay, you're you're a model. You're a it's model. Like soccer. Yeah, you're a model. Right, but what country has actually been able to uh, export soccer as India has with cricket? No, no. But I mean, a lot of countries have cricket as the number National one sport. sport yeah. yeah. I mean, even Australia. I was surprised. New Zealand. New Zealand. Uh, UK, yeah. bro. You. Yeah. The game no, was from UK. The cricket. game was from yeah. UK. UK yeah. cricket. Yeah. Yeah. The UK was the one who who invented, who cricket. invented cricket. Yeah. yeah. And soccer, yeah, <laughs> and all of them. All, <laughs> of, these people, all of the, all of these companies. Are, nah, soccer was from China, bro. Well, who the fuck told you that? Who the fuck told the you that? Mongolians invented soccer. <laughs> Look at Chinese. The Mongolians. Look how funny they are. All the fucking, all of them from, uh, from fucking east of China, uh, all the way to who, who, who's Europe. It was all Mongolian people. Bro. Where, where, all where did you get oh, that fake news from? Okay. Well, okay, they were close to being Chinese. They were, they were, they are close to be, but they had uh, like. Different but genetically, there's some there's the Mongolian. Genetic. Football was I, invented you, by okay. English. No, no, this is what what the Mongolians used to cut people's heads off and play. It. <laughs> yeah, no, no, that is true. That is true. That is true. I mean, that is true. Do you have proof of that? Yeah, that is true. Yeah, actually, 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 that is true. You know why? That when you, true. yeah, when you look. But at that happened through no, whole, whole history. So but that's when, not when, what soccer no, is, yo. No, 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 no. They used to. They they are there are scriptures which used to say that Mongolians used to chop their enemies heads off and play f- f- soccer around you. How? Uh, the Turkish Empire, the Ottoman Empire, yeah. before... They called it soccer. No, not <laughs> soccer. Something. Something. We don't care. Something it's else. it's a it similar game. And it's and they put a world. net in there and they kick it into the Who net knows? and count one, they, they two, they yellow might. card, red end card, and all of that end, shit. No, end nah, up, nah, nah, the, end the white up. man came and took it and put fucking Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. So, let's say 3,000 years ago, in the old Egyptians... Yeah. They cut someone's balls and they threw it. So they invented basketball. <laughs> yes, they did. <laughs> <laughs> what did they throw? Did they throw it in a basket? <laughs> I would say, I would say, basketball was not a good option. I'd say cornhole is a good one. It was the same size you throw it. The cornhole, you know, you know, you know, you know yeah, the cornhole. Uh, that, that's way more logical. Anyways, you guys are fucked up. You guys are going that, through that, many that's, dimensions. That's way more logical. A lot of people, see, when you come about, when you like say about the girls, Bro, half of what? the social media, the social media girls, the models, they consider themselves models. They consider themselves models. They are, they are coming on the internet and showing off their bodies. They are doing what they are doing. Fine. Fine. 
You think it's how- their body. If you're going to go pay $8 a month and watch it, that's not their problem. See yourself in the mirror, you'll find a pussy. You're paying $8 to <laughs> see a pussy. See yourself in the mirror, you're the one. <laughs> Bro, courts on courts. You, will, <laughs> you, you will find a pussy. See yourself in the mirror and you will find a pussy. Yes. <laughs> you, you, pay, you pay. They just destroyed you. Look like you if, if I were you. <laughs> No, he's not talking to me. You're talking to me. That's not me. He's talking general, bro. You paying? It. No, no, that's what I'm, I'm saying. I'm saying that if they're paying eight ninety nine, if you're paying eight ninety nine for it, like that's not your problem. So you're paying eight. Why are you complaining you're, that they're models you're, you're, on social media? You're paying two dollars. You're paying one dollar to to watch a, a girl do some random shit. On that the is internet. your own problem. No, that's not your own problem. Go. Find a it mirror is in your, your own house, problem. Stand in front of it. You it will is, find a pussy over there. It is your own problem. Okay, let's change the, let's change the conversation. Uh, All right, a topic. Next topic. Next gig stuff. economies. I have this gig kind economy. of like... Yeah, I have this uh, idea or concept. Well, maybe not me, but... Um, I think... As humans... I think... I think... I think uh, Eric is a leosexual... Uh, so that means uh, he follows uh, Leonardo DiCaprio. I, he only dates women from 18 to 24. <laughs> I mean, I would 100% date women from 18 bro. to 24. I mean, what's wrong? And with when that they thing? turn 26, he leaves them. So he's the Leo sexual. <laughs> oh, that's a new sexuality now. Oh, that's a new sexuality. Yeah, a, so that's what they call Leo Leonardo, Leonardo, Leonardo so, DiCaprio. So you, so, so you, oh, only, so right. you only date you only date women who are but, from. But I mean, he might break this rule if he dated someone thirty years old, right? He, no, that's a made up. Yeah, that's a made up. Yeah, I didn't. Know I, that. Yeah, I consider uh, Eric as a Leo I'm sexual. I'm a Leo. <laughs> I, just, yes. I actually just turned Leo sexual everywhere. <laughs> Thank you. Nice, no, nice, nice. Yeah, that's one, that's one, that's one. Uh, yeah, I consider it. Uh, yeah. Eric is, uh, we don't give a fuck what you say. Because it's zero fucks. Do you know what a sapio sexual? I I I I I knew no I knew about it but I uh, uh, like you knew about it yeah but I don't remember it sorry sapiosexual someone who in, someone is interesting in other people's mind not their body damn sapiosexual I I and, and there's an I like I've I've been playing a game called as Assassin's Creed Origins uh-huh. so it's a game based on ancient Egypt uh, 49 BCE uh-huh. like ancient Egypt. So there's a character of Cleopatra. So I took time because I am very You're much to go marry here. No, 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 I'm very much in. No, 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 I am very much. I am very much interested like in interested her. in. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm very. I'm very. <laughs> I'm, very much, I'm I am very much. I'm. I. I. Like since a young age, I'm very much uh, interested in oh. Egyptian history. Did so, she? So no, no, no. Let me. Let me conclude. Let me. Con- let me say this. <laughs> And I, 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 I did a, I did a, I did a small, I did a small research on this. I did a small research on this, and it turns out Cleopatra, uh-huh. the the queen of uh, Egypt back in the day, uh-huh. she was hypersexual. In what terms of mean? like, what does that mean? So every like one like she was so she was she was so hypersexual uh-huh. that there are scriptures and there are uh, historical uh, stuff which says that she used to. Uh, have sex with hundred men in a single night, so she and she done. had a vibrator made of angry bees. <laughs> and guess what? She had a statement. She had a statement that sh- I will like. She will sleep with anyone uh, who dares to get executed in the morning. And there were a lot of men in. Can you uh, repeat the last part? Uh, and there were a lot of men. Yeah. Uh, so uh, Cleopatra used to like sleep with hundred men. <laughs> Not all the way from here. <laughs> okay, Cleopatra had a Cleopatra had a Cleopatra. Yeah, the thing about the men yeah that's what I'm saying. Okay. Yeah, Cleo, Cleo, <laughs> Cleopatra, Cleopatra had a code for herself. Uh-huh. Like she used to t- t- tell this to every single one who used to come in a courthouse. She's like, I'll sleep with anyone. Like she will sleep with anyone. Uh, who dares to get executed in the morning? 
so there are a lot of uh, uh, egyptian history that i read uh, that quick question i don't know who cleo is cleo pat you would you sleep with her do you know who no, that no. is there are there are a lot no, of that's what i'm saying no 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 i'm just trying to make a, i'm just trying to rate i'm just trying to figure out who will sleep with cleo right here from sleeping with a thousand men uh-huh. absolutely not that nah, is definitely got right. syphilis what bro what about you what about you <laughs> cleo no would obviously you? not no, right. it, it, it against my hold on, hold stuff on. i follow hold on hold on he asked you he, he asked you both or a queen or whatever he asked you both yeah he asked you both I, 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 I'm her? not going to oh, so you both do you know who is really do you know who Cle- that is do you know who that is oh, oh, that's oh, the oh. most beautiful woman on earth Cleopatra. yeah Cleopatra Basically. Cleopatra was the most beautiful woman in the ancient the yeah <laughs> no I, <laughs> let, let, let me say but, this let but, I mean that, that information about the hundred man me, let, was the source Omar so I don't know about that pull, pull it over pull it over if I if I if it I, is I, it is probably true it no. is definitely true yeah look it I've up I've heard up. about it somewhere look it up look it up and there yeah I've there heard are, about there it somewhere are, there, there are what is Cleopatra's body count <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one that's a good one <laughs> ask the AI <laughs> What is Cleopatra's body count? Let's ask Elon Musk. <laughs> Untangling the real details. 10,000. <laughs> She slept with more than 10,000 men. And, and what I'm saying, and you know, and a lot of girls nowadays they would count, they would reach the number. I'll, 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 I'll guess at 500. I'll let me let me like, let, let me counting. let me tell you this. There are some. 10,000. Yeah, there are some instances. There How? Are, that's no, a whole no, army, bro. Yeah, that's. <laughs> le- It, no, even no. one <laughs> jesus anyways yeah, yeah, yeah keep going let me let, <laughs> see oh, I, i bring in, i bring i bring spicy topics over here okay uh, take take credit for cleo yeah, yeah. all right yeah. go ahead and and there are and there are spiritual uh, like uh, historical scriptures which said uh-huh. there were more than 5000 to 10000 men uh-huh. who slept with yeah, we verified in the morning we verified they that they, died, they, died. they got executed in the morning yeah of course that's what she you can't You yeah. can't talk and, bro. And 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 yeah. and 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 when she was dead, when she was about to die, she gave a statement saying that no man can find my burial place. They haven't found her burial place yet. There's work going on in Egypt right now. A woman scientist. Mm-hmm. She found a passageway which might lead to Cleo. Fuck, did you have to say a woman scientist? Yeah. She's a woman and she's a scientist. Why well, you have to know that? She- No, it's because the reason why I told the woman scientist is Cleopatra clearly said in that scripture. No man, no, man can, no man can find my burial spot. Oh, spine. that's and deep. And a female fan. And a female scientist. You can you can look it up right now. Uh, a female scientist, a female lead scientist. She's on her way. Like she's working on to uh, find a uh, find the burial spot of uh, Cleo. What I'm saying, we're talking about. But anyway, I would treat that as a year old woman. And, Hold and on. Syphilis and syphilis, gonorrhea, AIDS, and everything. They were discovered recently. Okay, they were all. They are all new oh, wow, decisions. No shit, they are all new wow. decisions. I just knew that. Wow. wow. They might have. They might have. But biologically, scientifically written 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 records were recent. When you look when you look at like history, I have never read like so far. I might I might have like missed something, but I have never read saying that oh there's a sexual disease uh, like this community. This yeah, because they didn't fucking know. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yes. No, that's what yeah, I'm saying. Oh, your dick fell off. Hold bro, on, they they, they found they they oh, bro the I'm technology I'm I'm the technology <laughs> no the even though technology what's your point? even though technology what's your point? even though technology what's your was point? let me say it <laughs> what's your point let me conclude you look what's the point what's the point of all this we're talking about a woman 3000 years old she's dead <laughs> the beauty standards of that time might not be applied know, to this bro. time yes. so she's not the most beautiful woman on earth period 100%. No, I'm, I'm, I just I just bought the topic up. That I just wanted to share this topic. That oh, I remember my topic. All right, yeah, what do you yeah. guys think about gig economies? Gig economy. what, yeah. What, so basically, the that? idea that you can't you you work for yourself now. You're 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 uh, a freelancer. Um, so here is what basically brought up or is kind of driving that thought. Um, when when basically the world first started let's say to assume like everyone was just running around and grabbing whatever they wanted right until we got organized and people started to own shit and slavery happened and 
they said oh banned slavery and companies now happened and now we're having like all of this issues happening with companies and people are realizing that oh working for a company yeah i get the sense of security and all of that but I, i can also go risk it and it might pay off in the long run and people are like taking that path and like risking it and kind of like doing things on their own but actually coming out and making it or kind of struggling for the first years but if once you do it 10 years 15 years like it pays off and my idea is that now the future of work and having to like feed yourself and do things is kind of like going towards that gig economy again it's not going to be like running around it's technically running around and trying to feed yourself but mostly going to be online and kind of like doing that kind of things and that's kind of so no what 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 you're telling me is like uh like individual economy like what that yeah you? basically yeah, like no, yeah. an individual person yeah no, because you know, no like you no you're yeah, you're so saying everyone. yeah you're you're telling me that people are being selfish and they're only thinking about themselves no not the people families. are being selfish that's what the world is going yeah that's no no, no. The, you, you're, you're telling they're providing themselves not they're not thinking about the families the, is that not what? necessarily families he's talking about here I'm talking about the idea of you going to college and graduating and going to get and a job working for somebody else instead of working. doing that you would be working for yourself by creating something of value for other people through a specific channel which will be online. Right. Now you will get paid for it. So it's like it's like pe- people on TikTok dancing and then getting exactly. paid for it, sponsorships and stuff. So now that's the gig economy on which it, it comes to like you don't necessarily have to go sit in a cubicle or work for someone and that's how and you that's how Kylie Jenner became time, fucking a billionaire. T- yes. Uh, times times are changing and people are getting lazier. That's it. I would say all of the uh, things what nowadays for example TikTok. TikTok mm-hmm. is a platform where you uh, shake your waist for like 15 seconds and you're making millions out of it mm-hmm. why because people are lazy people are lazy people are not going in the traditional form anymore the world you has mean ch- the majority of people lazy no the or, or the whole people are not becoming lazy. some i'm not gonna say majority i would say 20 percent of the current economy of so america 20 to 30 percent the person watching the tiktok or the person making the tiktok is lazy yes <laughs> okay what if, what if you like walking and watching tiktok Look around the world. Look around the world around no, you. No, I'm look, trying to say look, that. Look I'm saying the that the world is now becoming the person making TikTok. And like, no matter what you do, like even if you go and you like work at a company and come back and go back, you're technically making a TikTok for someone. Right. But why wouldn't you just make that TikTok for yourself? Like you're thinking about it as in TikTok, as in just the social media platform. I'm talking TikTok as in content wise, as in like your whole you're, life you're telling, you're walking, telling me you're telling me rather than making yourself a millionaire you're making somebody else a millionaire kind of okay. we're realizing that that's what, the, that's what the the generation that has come before us have been doing yes, right yes that, that is how the whole world is being run by like like good amount of years i can say like more than 200 300 or 500 or thousands of years there's very, there's very few uh there's the, there very, very yeah there's very few there's very few rich people compared to the general population and now if we had a gig economy i think that would open up that that's my thought about what you're asking that would open up well for everybody because <clears throat> now i'm witnessing people that are living in ghana for instance that are doing youtube and they're making fucking hundred thousand dollars a month and they live they live everywhere like everywhere in a, a part of the corner so this is actually a really good uh, a, a very good opportunity for everybody in, in I guess in general to just I guess this is going to be the, the new way of distributing wealth in the, in, the, in the whole so that's when they say like a utopia of like success and be honest like we're not even going to work anymore because the robots are going to be doing all the jobs anyway so we're going to be just getting fed I guess we cannot all afford it because we all getting paid to do something exactly. else. No, I would say I would say uh, clearly when you look at this, I would say the people who are making TikToks or your or the people who are making videos, I would, I I respect Why are you them. back to that subject? We're done. No, I, con- I, I, continue after what he said about feeding people about and uh, the robots. Yeah. So no. what what I think that in the future, that as he said that that we won't worry about food, but I think it's all gonna be about the social status. What do you think, Luke? I mean, yeah, it's yeah, it's going to be all about the social status in the future. Mm. Um, I mean, everything is going to be 
customized, right? Like mm, that's interesting. Yeah, yeah. everyone is gonna want custom so customized. Shit. It's gonna be the yeah. So it's gonna be like yeah, you can get custom or you can get generic. Yeah. So yeah. right. So before, prior to us getting to this point, but uh. Social status was based on the amount of money you got in your bank account. Exactly. But if a 15-year-old... Or the power before that. Uh, uh, exactly, before that, yeah. Yeah. Sword, it was yeah. It was how many people f- will follow you to yes, war. Exactly. Right. So now if we are making wealth distributed evenly, not evenly, at least partial evenly, to, uh, towards everybody, now social status is how many numbers you got on, on what platform? Not, not even... No, I'm not saying... I'm not yeah. saying even like only in like social media and, right. and, and we're talking in general like yeah. you walking the street people looking at you that's your social side that's what that's people gonna compete as as Luke said everything gonna be customized like, yeah right. like your let, eye let, right, let, right let, now let, everyone's eyes let, like let, organic yeah, right yeah. like once you get there someone will go get yeah, it, 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 again, I don't wow know, right? it's every, every time in a good subject 